in india today uh, we are doing close to 3 to 3 and a half lakh crore worth of capex every year across more than 15000 plus uh, manufacturing companies i don't think you should look at that as a trade off okay especially going forward i would strongly the moment you start saying i'm looking at a trade off and literally i'm willing to go to x percent of quality for y percent of cost okay that then becomes a moving line yeah what we found to be very very helpful is lay down your not non negotiable on one or the other so i really feel that you know this is a space where the criticality of digital tools is at most because spend is humongous the scope is complicated and multiple stakeholders and multiple parties are involved while organizations still try to monitor it and control it by using excel or very basic tools right and why they don't invest in tools is because they do it probably once in uh, 10 years once in 15 years right well, no, not every organization puts a factory every after every 2 years right so this is the stark reality that while if you sum total the infrastructure spend it's so huge but it's still getting governed by a simple thing like excel in most of the organization that's where i feel a criticality of these tools is there i just wanted to ask for ac as in environmental clearance and cto as in consent to operate Okay. So uh, since I kind of uh, uh, represent the steel industry, uh, so I just wanted to understand that these are all uh, these are all very cru- uh, crucial uh, uh, approvals from the uh, GOI government of India. Maybe from what we have experienced in terms of environmental clearance or consent to operate, of course, I mean, it's something where we have to deal with the state authorities. and there is uh, because these are state matter subjects at least what i have seen in few of the projects the rules change from state to state the efficiency and the competence of the regulatory authorities also varies from state to state it has always been a pleasure working with you and honestly in our last two years of association uh, we have seen tremendous value coming out of it and i'm very excited uh with the future possibilities uh which we have in exploring this digital tool and this uh, space which you have